Hello YouTube, welcome to another episode of Kincaid Creations. I am your host Kincaid. I would like to say first off, thank you all for all of your fantastic support, all the views, likes, subscriptions, uh, even the comments make a difference. All of it, I really do appreciate it. So thank you all for your contributions, we'll call it. Um, I really do appreciate it. Today, I, oh, also I would like to say thank you for uh, tolerating my horrib or horrid upload schedule. I really do apologize. I gotta work on that. But not the point. You came here today to see Legos, and that's what we're about to get into. Today, in celebration of Mortal Kombat 11's release, I have created a minifigure of the Cryomancer himself, Sub-Zero. It turned out very well, actually. I used a blue J chest from Ninjago Season 4, then simply some black legs, peach arms, black hands, and a black... Uh, Cole Ninjago mask. The sword is also Ninjago. It's from the blades with the genie, uh, not a con, where he had his special blades that captured all the ninja. This one is Nia's specifically, hence the lighter blue. And then I used one of the power blasts, the blue ones, for it to make it look like he's kind of summoning some ice right at his side like he does. Under the helmet, we got, the, well, under the ninja mask, we got this face here. I don't actually know what it's from, but it just seemed like it would fit. Now, I know Eleven, he's got the beard and all, but short notice, and I could not exactly find that because bearded faces in Peach are rare, as I've found out, apparently. But not important. What is important is that I got this made, and I'm going to get it uploaded in time. By the time you guys view this, it'll be uh, probably later. But nonetheless, it looks phenomenal. I would have preferred a different torso, but other than that, it's great. So thank you all very much for taking some of your time to watch this, and I hope you all have a pleasant evening. 